Hey everyone, I'm making this video because not enough of us understand what awareness implies. In this world, the control system operates through humanity. And a lot of you watching this, a lot of people understand this intellectually. They grasp this. They, they even, they know this on a, cert, on a certain level to a certain degree. But that's not enough. We have to be so aware of this to not create what they want us to create. The brainwash masses are constantly eating up all this information and all this false bullshit that the news and everything else puts out all the time, all the narratives, and they create it. We know this. Most of society creates this hell that we find ourselves in physically. But even in the truth community, there's all there's a whole other segment here of the alternative media and all these, you know, truthers putting out all this information about the government and how all these secret projects are about to be released and these mass extermination camps and all these mad vaccines and microchips, all this stuff. But do you see what's going on there? Do you see it? What's happening is, although they're putting out very useful information to be aware of, and we need to understand these things because they will happen if we do not see it with awareness and not feed it. You see, they put these ideas out there and they've been putting these ideas out there for a long time because they want us to create it. And you go, oh, Lawrence, I know this. I know this. Why are you making this video? I understand. No. Do you actually understand? Deeply, do you understand? We have to be in a state of pure awareness when we're watching these videos. And that's the essence of this short video I'm putting out right now. We're listening and watching podcasts and we're watching videos and we're absorbing information about the dark occultists and how they operate and how they manifest things in the world and what they use, the taxes are using, and most importantly, all this information about these dark secret projects that they're going to roll out and all these extermination camps and all these things that they want to see happen. When we assume mentally, when we're operating from only the mind, only a psychological level, and we're taking this in and we're assuming it unconsciously, assuming that unconsciously it's true, because this happens very subtly. This happens very, 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 very subtly. When I'm watching a video and it, say it's talking about blackouts, mass blackouts, and you know, black bag and truth seekers and all this stuff, I'm watching this video and I'm getting caught up and emotionally involved with my thoughts about this happening. And then all of a sudden I'm preparing psychologically for this event to take place. What do you think that's doing? It's, it's solidifying in the world. I'm creating it. So you see what's happening? This is what's going on. So I'm speaking to the truth community here. We need to be aware of what we're watching. We need to be aware, just pure awareness. It's not an intellectual process. It's not something that you can just try to do. It's just sitting back and observing everything. It's observing your whole entire internal world when you're in certain environments and when you're absorbing certain knowledge and when you're around certain people. It's observing your thoughts. It's observing your emotions. It's observing your feelings. It's observing your behavior. It's observing your actions. You're not getting super involved with things in that, in that area. Now, on the contrary, it's very useful. It's a very useful tool to really engage in that thought process. That's how you create goodness in the world. That's how you create beauty in the world and balance in the world is you, you live as if it already exists. You live as if the dark occult, occultists of the world and the alien race that's behind everything, whatever, is already dismantled and dissolved and it's gone. And there's nothing but balance in the world or in, on the earth. It's useful there, but where it's tricky and where it hurts the shit out of us it's when we do the same thing and apply the same principle to the knowledge that they're putting out and saying, this is going to happen. Guys, you better get ready by the end of the year. There's going to be hardcore riots. Shit's going to hit the fan. I mean, it's going to be insane. And we're in, the, we're in the truth community over here like, oh, man, we got we to gotta get ready. It's going to happen. It's gonna, see? It's going to happen. It's going to happen. We got to spread to everybody and infect everybody else's mind and plant these seeds about what's going to happen. You better watch out. You better get, I'm not saying preparedness isn't good. I I – I'm prepared. Physically, I am prepared for whatever, whatever's going to happen. But I'm personally, am not in, I'm not getting involved in it psychologically. I'm not allowing myself to manifest that reality. I see what they're trying to do. Not only to the brainwashed masses that they're doing every day, but to us in the truth community. They are planting seeds in our minds because 
We don't possess the awareness on a large enough scale in the truth community to combat it. So what I'm, the essence of this video is this. Be careful. Be careful when you're watching certain videos and taking in certain information. Just observe what you're watching. Don't allow that seed to be planted in the subconscious mind because it happens so subtly and so sneakily. It just, it just slips right in that subconscious mind and then all of a sudden you're seeing this crazy thing happen in this, in this reality and all this shit's coming to fruition and we're, we're all like, told you so, told you it's going to happen, all this truth is, oh, I told you the microchips are going to happen, I told you all this stuff. But, you know, the funny thing is, not only did the brainwashed masses manifest it through all the Black Mirror shows and all these other shows, but we in the truth community manifested it as well because we bought the narrative unconsciously. You know, we could watch it and say, fuck that. That's not going to happen. I'm not going to let that happen. I'm going to expose this system and I'm going to get as much information out there as possible. And I'm going to spread this truth like wildfire. It's not going to happen. But even if we're doing that and we bought the narrative and we bought that, the reality that it will happen, you see, not that it might happen, but it will happen. And that happens on a deep psychological level that we have to be aware of, then we're perpetuating it as well. So all I'm saying is be careful when you're watching videos and you're listening to people. And this applies to all videos and everything you listen to. Don't assume it's going to happen. Don't assume that it's truth. Don't assume that it's right. Listen to your heart. Be aware of your own feelings. Be aware of your own intuition. Understand it deeply and really just observe. Observe and see what the system is trying to do because the si the control system and these sick fucks are in everything. They're in everything. Even the most secretive, secret knowledge that you can ever absorb. They got a piece of that. They know what's going on. Trust me, they know what's going on. Lastly, I want to say that I am currently working on a presentation titled Freedom and Natural Law, which I'll be having out by uh, hopefully mid-October. So look forward to that. It's going to be a big one. I'm most likely going to present it in two to three segments, depending on how long the video actually is. So I'm excited to share that with you and uh, look forward to that. Thanks, y'all. Stay aware.